Okay, hello everyone. Uh, I'm Ollie Four. Welcome back to my channel. This is going to be slightly more of an informational video. Uh, there isn't going to be much to watch in the video. It's more just listen to. It's an update on uh, what's going on in uh, in Greenpoint um, because uh, there's uh, there's some changes that are going through. Um, uh, so GCSO has been um, or is going through complete reforms. The old sheriff uh, Lucas was um, terminated, uh, and his spot was taken by uh, by the very capable person, uh, K9. Um, K9 has chosen ITAG as his under sheriff, and myself as his chief deputy sheriff. Um, reason this happened was the department was inactive. It was less active than GFM, which is well known to be the least active department in Greenpoint, or at least it is so by the people that I have talked to. Um, and when K9 uh, brought the idea up to uh, police about reforms and how it should get more active, there were only 13 sworn members in the entire department, which uh, is a pretty uh, terrible number considering that uh, state police has just gone over 100 members, which is great, uh, and we'll get back to that later. But um, so GCSO got completely reformed, um, and there we're working on new applications, new database, and everything, and that's going to be completely reformed. Uh, and I hope to see more people joining this, and we are going to do our very best to bring this back up to a standard that is acceptable and that there's going to be a, a good amount of people in the department working. Um, moving on to federal marshals, the also known inactive department is... Um, I'm the captain, or a captain, as a lot of people know, uh, along with the uh, other people that uh, just got accepted into captains, which is great, and uh, congrats on everybody. Uh, I, the application process, apparently, from what I've heard, was not um, great, uh, as uh, apparently the applications were lost, and then they did applications over DMs. I'm not sure if that's true or not, but it's okay. Um, moving on, uh, so... Greenpoint Federal Marshals, um, there is some talk about that has to get more active or uh, it might like move to a different uh, federal department. Um, I'm not going to throw out any ideas or anything, but it could go to a different federal, I'd, so it'll drop marshals and go to something else. Uh, I don't know if that's going to happen or what about that. Um, uh, then in Port Authority, I am the uh, Deputy Commissioner. Uh, Two ranks below the commissioner Schneider, uh, that uh, has been a lot like that for a while, uh, and then state police, the department that has just reached a hundred members, which is insane, and is amazing. Um, it's uh, I, the major. Uh, I'm the new major. Um, so yeah, that's some of the big departments that are hap big departmental changes that are happening. Um, I am, uh, currently going through, uh, some thoughts of, uh, resigning from the Sponsored Gamer because though it is amazing to have this and to create videos, and I will not stop making videos, making two of them a week, um, I can see might start to get a stretch as I am now in every single department in Greenpoint, uh, and I don't want to have to force myself to do it when I'm also trying to balance things out with uh, starting up pretty much a department and um, that and just working on all of that. So we'll see how it all goes and um, I'll keep you guys updated. Uh, so congrats to um, State Police for hitting 100 members and for Port Authority who's uh, I think are going to get pretty close to that at the end of the applications which are closing soon uh, and which are ongoing now. Uh, and I'll keep you guys updated on G GCSO and uh, what we do there. And uh, as always, I'll keep you guys updated with everything. So uh, I'll see you guys later. Thanks very much.